Dallas Time Lapse. Uh, this is the Dallas skyline. You can barely make it out, break a day. There's low clouds around. You can see those clouds trying to clear out. Still a little bit of haze in the air. That's because of really the high dew points in the air. It's very humid out there, especially when you consider where we are in late October. Uh, near record heat this weekend. I mean, dress accordingly. We're going to have temperatures in the upper 80s both today and tomorrow. It's going to be mostly dry weekend. I'm going to show you some small rain and storm chances uh, here in a moment, but it's mostly dry for most of North Texas. Storms are in the forecast late Sunday in a particular place out in the Northeast, and then the better chance of rain for everybody across North Texas comes Tuesday, and that's when we transition back to some fall weather. So current conditions, it is very much a late summer morning. We got temperatures in the 70s, upper 60s. It's breezy, it's humid. It just feels like rain is in the air when it's like this. But really, if you're heading out to the Bell Fort Worth Alliance Air Show, you'll probably only have to deal with some uh, breezy conditions. As we cross the afternoon, the winds will be picking up as we close the day. Temperatures will get into the mid 80s. Keep in mind, that's about 10 degrees above normal. Uh, 88 is the forecast for tomorrow, despite the cloud cover we think will be around, especially early on. The small rain chances, you know, if we take a look down the 45 corridor and 35, this is where I think the best chance of rain will be not only this morning, but later on in the day you'll see a, a few sprinkles, maybe a, a rumble of thunder or two, but the coverage is probably 20% or less. This is how it looks, by the way, Sunday morning. Just a lot of clouds and a few sprinkles with the low clouds. There's a front coming towards us. It stalls, and it looks like along the Red River from Paris over to Sherman and maybe into Collin County and to Hunt County, there are some small storm chance as some of the forecast models show a few thunderstorms developing, but that's pretty much it for rain and storm chances this weekend. Warm and breezy is the theme and look at these temperatures compared to the highs for the day. Today's high of 87. That's the record 91 88 for the forecast tomorrow. That's the record 90 and we could get within a degree of time the record high on Monday. And like I said, it's very windy out there. What's interesting about the wind, it picks up at the end of the day and then it stays breezy all night. I mean, we have strong winds. This is midnight. Strong winds through the night. You'll probably hear it rattle in the windows through the night. The strong winds will be around in the morning and pretty much most of the day tomorrow. I really think tomorrow will be windier than it is today, but both days very breezy. It's because of this low pressure system. It's just going to get close enough pulling up all the south wind. And we really got several days of, of very windy conditions ahead. Let me show you the seven day forecast because there's good news. Uh, we, we have this rain and thunderstorm event late Tuesday into Wednesday morning. Then, then we get back to fall. So very, very unusually warm. Then we have temperatures falling. By the time we get into Halloween, and to that weekend, you see what's happening to the temperatures. They're falling, and it's going to be very fall-like by Thursday and Friday, and just near perfect weather, sunshine, temperatures low 70s. The only caveat here, Nicole, is that Thursday and Friday will also be very windy.